Hi, good to see you again. Here we're going to look at efficient techniques for selecting cell ranges. You can select a, cell, a range of cells in a few different ways. So to select a column, I'll just select um, one single cell where I want to start. The whole key is make sure the cursor does not change. If for some reason you're somewhere else in the cell and the cursor changes, you're not selecting properly. So go to the middle of the cell, press the left mouse key, and drag down as far as you want to select um, numbers or so in columns. You could do the same thing with this, uh, a row. So I'm going to click in C5, make sure that my cursor is the same, and I'm just going to go across. We could also select a whole column. Like if I select A3, I can go all the way to uh, B8 and collect uh, this whole table here. So, you know, bigger or small as you want. There's another way to select. For a column, I'm going to click in D3. I'm going to move my cursor down to D8. I'm going to push the Shift key and select a second time. So that selects there. Could do that with the row also. Um, C5, I'm going to go to F5, press down the Shift key, click. And of course, we could do for a table. So C3 to F8, boom, I selected uh, the whole thing. There's one other select key that comes in handy. If you want to select a whole workbook, you go up in between the 1 and the A, this little triangle up there. This is the Select All button. And you can see there, it selects my entire uh, worksheet. Thank you for watching, and we'll see you soon.